Mexico is one of the countries with highest inequality and lowest social mobility in the world. This social rigidity leads to opportunity hoarding, where those starting from a disadvantaged position will have fewer opportunities to succeed, whereas those born into privileges continue to amass further advantages throughout their lifetime, which they are then able to pass on to their children. It is thus important to scrutinize people's perceptions of social mobility and the relationship between inequality and mobility as to both its effects and mechanisms. In this study, El Colegio de México and Centro de Estudios Espinosa Iglesias investigate how do Mexicans perceive inequality and social mobility levels in the country. Subjective experience of inequality and social mobility helps explain why people tolerate differences between rich and poor and has important effects on political behavior and policy preferences, hence affecting real inequality and social mobility outcomes. Although empirical evidence indicates little change in the indicators, many Mexicans seem to hold a continuously strong belief in meritocracy. This is problematic since it means that on the one hand, individuals' lack of success is blamed on their lack of effort and or talent instead of scrutinizing the structural obstacles of a deeply stratified system impeding social ascent. On the other hand, policy recommendations to address inequality continue to focus on poverty relief and educational increases instead of more effective solutions involving fiscal policies of redistribution. The main methodological tool we use in our study is a multi-location survey based on a questionnaire which records perceptions of inequality and social mobility. We will collect data at different geographical locations across the country. Each location will feature both high and low income participants. Additionally, we will conduct a sample of elite interviews at each location to gauge in what way their perceptions might differ from those of the rest.